This video will help you start and then publish your presentation for your, your story presentation for Project One. So what you first need to do is go to log in to your Maricopa Gmail account. I like to go to google.maricopa.edu to do that. And I'm already logged in. Now remember in the upper left hand corner there's a link that says documents. Go to documents. To start a presentation, click Create New Presentation. To rename it, go up here in the left-hand corner and click where it says Untitled Presentation and give it a new title. Sample story. Give it a little something a little bit more descriptive than ENG 101 Project One. Try to give it a you know a descriptive title. Now, your first slide, remember your first slide, it only had very basic information in it. Title, your name, course info, date, etc. Review the uh, um, assignment prompt to get all the information. You can choose to put pictures on this page or you can leave it blank. Now, the important thing that everyone needs to pay attention to where all the text of your story is going to go, it's going to go over here in the lower right hand corner. There's a little speaker notes button. Click that. This space over here, that is where your story, the actual written story, is going to go. So, I'm going to go to an example that's a little bit fleshed out already. So, up here, again, there's that project title. And then over here on the right would be the first one to two paragraphs starting the story. Remember you have to start on page one. So that might be another reason why you want a picture on this page as well. But page one is the only page that you can have text on the slide because it's giving the information. All the other slides are just images. Now if you choose to, well, so there's page one, it has text, you can choose to put an image. And you start your story with the speaker's notes. Now we're going to go on to page two or slide two. There's one pic picture here. You would have you know one to two more paragraphs of your story and now what you need to start having is image citations and in the other video I gave more detail but in short you give a brief title so this I'm calling colored books CC image that's Creative Commons remember you search Creative Commons image posted at Flickr by and that's the username of the person and I made this a hyperlink and as a hyperlink it means I can link out to the page in Flickr where this image is that's how you test it to make sure it's working right so you're gonna just keep doing this so again we have another slide that has two images this time so it means I have two citations and again you'd have more paragraphs of your story now, when you're done, so say we're done with the story, what you're going to need to do is up here in the right-hand corner, click on the down arrow and click Publish. And Publish Document. Now, the important thing when you are turning this in is this URL or web address right here at the top of the page. So I'm going to copy that. That is what you're going to need to ultimately turn in for your project is that URL. Because look, if I go and paste that in, we get a slide page and you're like, where's my story? If we go down to actions here, show speaker notes, and there will be the story and the image citations. So that's how you will be starting and publishing or finishing your project for project number one.